Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> it's your boy Cam Breeze, the color man, back again. I just want to talk y'all about what what's going on in real life. This is something different. This is not about no no generation, nothing else. This is something important about the police brutality and the justice system. Cause the real reason why I make a video about this, this is why I really don't have respect for the police like that. Because one, most of the time they don't really do their job they good. And two, they think they could do whatever they want to do because they got that badge and gun. And three, I don't care what race a person is. You should always come for backup when somebody calling you. And you should check always check for identification because you don't know if this person is lying. Because sometimes people do be lying about their age and stuff. Because I'm in bed right now, but... I just don't feel like getting up right now. I just want to tell y'all, this is why I really don't have respect for the police brutality in the system. Because this kind of go back watching Straight out of Compton, All Eyes on Me, Jeffrey Dahmer series, and all these little serial killers. And then that kind of go back to this TV show I couldn't really couldn't watch like that over and over get thir uh when they see a Central Park fire. And then what's, what's, what really pissed me off, like Jeffrey Dahmer, this might have killed about 17 people. All the time you had this man, you never, you catch him. But then when the five boys got accused of rape, you gave them sons of bitches. You gave them seven, them sons of bitches gave them 17 <coughs> years. And that really fucked me up. It really pissed me off. Because you should always treat everybody with respect. Black, white, Chinese, Jewish, Korean, anybody. I don't care what race or what religion they is. You treat everybody with respect. And then that kind of go back when I would talk about the music industry. And it's another thing I don't like about the music industry. Like when I was watching Straight Outta Compton and the Bobby Brown story. Like you always telling us how to perform, what to do on stage. But you don't never say nothing to them white performers. Cause like, like, it, and I ain't got nothing against nobody. I'm just speaking out the difference. Like, but you don't say nothing to the white folks who be performing. And then, to be honest, they did most stuff to us. Because, like, Molly Crew, they had a head on stage. And, and that other group that seen Put Some Sugar on me, they was having fire holes on the stage. But then, when N.W.A. made Fuck the Police, you want to arrest them. And I understand why they made that song. And I'm glad they made that song. Because you all, because one... I didn't like that black cop in, in straight out coming talking about is you niggas supposed to be somewhere. They wasn't even doing nothing. And then that kind of go back when Q got arrested. He wasn't even doing nothing. He was just trying to get home. Like the same thing with Drake. Drake didn't even do nothing because he was home. And then that kind of go back when I was watching Wu-Tang America Saga by Wu-Tang claim biopic. Like when Ghostface and RZA got jumped by some white boys, you just drove right by. Didn't even try to help with nothing. And then, uh, and then another scene that pissed me off when that cop, when that cop choked Hayes for no reason, cause he was being an Uncle Tom. Like you ain't had to kick that radio. You could have just told him turn it off or something. The only time you should use your gun when they got a weapon out on them, but don't kill them. Just, just shoot them somewhere in the leg, but don't kill them. That's all I'm just saying. And that really did piss me off about Jeffrey Dahmer. Like with, her, with his neighbor, Glenda Keever, kept calling these motherfuckers. These folks want to show up now. And then the last victim that got away, Tracy Elvis, he had a point to be upset. You know this man was killing people, and now you want to do something all of a sudden. But, but let me tell you something about my people. Sometimes, pe my black people, they do it to themselves. Because, one, when you sitting up there going to stores, flashing money everywhere, sagging, doing all kinds of dumb shit, you got to stop doing that because they give you a reason to do something to you. And that kind of go back when I watched this movie, Fear of a Black Hat. Like, that security guard had no business putting that mind over. It's not like the car was stolen or anything. And then that's how they do you. Like with Rodney King, Letitia Hall. I feel really felt bad for Letitia Hall and Rodney King. Especially Letitia Hall. Like that lady didn't have to shoot the girl. She was going to pay for the drink. Even, even if she was stealing, you could have just called the cops or something. You ain't had to shoot the damn girl. But see, it's like, like but that kind of go back to what Scarface was saying. We were all, Our people, we were always considered evil. Like Glenda Cleaver was saying. We they it's like they don't never it's like don't melt no matter what we do it's like we don't count 
But then they get mad when we protest against them. I don't care if them folks don't like it. Because that's why I really don't have respect for the cops. Because half of them dick they could do what they want to do. You should always check for ID and driver's license. That's what you should do. And if I was Glenn the Cleaver, I wouldn't sell no kind of war for them. I would have told them jokers, get the hell out of my face. Hell, I don't want nothing from you. Because all this time I tried to call you. And then I really felt bad for when she tried to say that little Asian boy that he killed. And then, but see, but see to be honest, it's most some of them victim fault. Because you sitting up there going places with nobody, with people you don't know. I don't care. I don't care what, how this person look. I'm not finna just go anywhere with somebody. I need to get to know you first. But that's all I'm gonna say. Uh, Good night, y'all. And, and and be safe and 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 always put God first. That's all I'm gonna say for right now. But just tune in.